The average man takes over 45 minutes getting ready in the bathroom every morning. That's over five hours a week, 22 hours a month, or 270 hours a year. So I'm gonna show you my 10 step, 10 minute morning grooming routine that I use so you can save over 200 hours a year and look better than any other guy. Let's get started. First, you will step in the shower and use the Navy shower technique. Look, showering in the morning takes time, but you have to take that time. Not only will you look better, but according to a study, the steam from the shower in the morning increases the oxidation in the brain, which leads to increased work efficiency. So here's how to do it in as little as 60 seconds with the Navy shower technique. To do this, you'll start by turning on the shower on for 15 seconds, get wet, and then turn it off. Then you will spend around 20 to 30 seconds putting on body wash, face wash, and shampoo in your hair. Then you will turn the shower on for another 25 seconds and rinse everything off. By just doing that, you just showered in under a minute, saving yourself a ton of time. But I'm just getting started because we move on to step number two. Quickly style your hair with hot and cold air. To save time in the morning, you need to learn how to use a hair dryer that gives you a double effect of both drying your hair while also texturizing it, giving it some style, which according to a study is a great way to have a youthful appearance. Now, to do this, grab the blow dryer, set it up on medium heat, and blow dry your hair in the general direction you want it to lay. Then as you're drying it, use your fingers to move the hair in multiple directions to start giving it some of that texture. To make the process faster, just get a better hair dryer. The one that I use is from a brand called Luifin, which has high-speed drying technology that dries my hair 5.5 times faster than your average hair dryer. And the best part about this hair dryer is that it keeps my hair healthy. Now, if you want to use the one that I use to speed things up, you can click the link down below and check out the hair dryers. However, I then set it up on the cooled setting, quickly dry my face from any moisture. Because this takes me to step number three. Shave your skin immediately after. You see, while showering, the steam will open up the pores on your face, releasing the hair follicles and allowing the closest, smoothest shave possible. Most men will therefore then shave their entire face right after the shower. You don't have to do that. Instead, you only want to shave parts of your face. Because according to a study by the Evolutionary Journal, the most attractive facial hairstyle is low stubble. So as soon as you've done drying your beard, I want you to grab a trimmer and use a clip card that's around seven millimeters. This is the exact desired length to get that low stubble appearance. Then I want you to outline your beard using a comb. You will line up the comb from the middle of your ear to the corner of your mouth on both sides. And then Using an eyebrow shaver tool, your skin is now prepped for a close shave. Remember, you're only shaving parts of your face. You will shave everything that's above that comb. Then, I want you to open your jaw as far as you can. You will create an imaginary line under your jaw. Everything under that line, you can also shave. At this point, you are only three minutes in and you've completely showered, gave your hair a texture, and even styled your beard. But we still got six minutes in our morning routine, so there's still a lot more left without wasting any time. Number four, immediately hydrate your skin using a moisturizer that has built-in sunscreen. When you shave and shower every morning, you strip your skin from natural oils and makes it vulnerable to the sun's damage. To look your best every day, you have to moisturize and use sunscreen daily. So here's exactly how you're gonna do it. First, find a two-in-one product that has a high-quality moisturizer with the sunscreen that has at least 30 SPF. Next, you will apply two coin-sized amounts on each of your cheeks, and then you will massage upward. The circular motion pushing upwards will enhance your lymphatic system and enhance blood circulation to give you a fuller appearance. And then, I want you to grab a towel and pat your skin dry to remove any excess product and avoid your skin looking oily. Five, quickly style your hair. I want you to grab your hair dryer again and some hair product. Now that your hair has had some time to air dry, you're gonna add a bit more texture to your hair with some sea salt spray or any sort of texturizing powder. Then, whatever product you use, you'll want to apply it in your hair, but here's the key. After you're done applying, I want you to set the hair dryer on the cool setting. So, I grab my lathe again, using a wide head to allow it to cool my scalp, which will constrict the muscles in my scalp. This will lock in your hair in place and cause it to keep that textured, perfect look all day long. This is why I keep emphasizing that as a man, a good hair dryer 
can speed up your entire morning routine. And if you want the best technology available, Leif and Hair Dryers is unmatched. So if you want to enhance your morning routine with technology that's going to make you more attractive, look no further. If you guys want to check it out, it'll be linked down below with an extreme discount for a limited time. Six, I want you to brush your teeth and your lips at the same time to increase facial contrast. During a study published by the National Library of Medicine, researchers found that the more contrast somebody has on their face between their eyebrows, lips, teeth, and skin, the more attractive they were perceived. Well, you can increase that contrast on your face while saving time, just your toothbrush. First, you're going to brush your teeth with a toothpaste that has whitening materials. So go check your toothpaste and read the ingredient label. It should have one of these, silica, hydrogen peroxide, or carbamide peroxide. This will whiten your teeth, which will increase the contrast between your teeth and your skin. Next, then you will brush your teeth for around a minute and 30 seconds. You will rinse the toothbrush and come back, and then you will exfoliate your lips for 10 seconds. By doing this, you will be exfoliating your lips, which will make them look more plump, but also increase the pink color of your lips by rushing blood to that area. This will increase the contrast between your lips and your skin. So far, we're six minutes in, which moves on to step number seven. You will use eye drops to increase facial contrast. During the same study that I mentioned earlier, researchers also found that having wider eyeballs also made you more attractive because it increased contrast against your skin tone color. So here's a quick way to whiten them right before you head out the door. First, you need some eye drops that contain vasoconstrictors, which make the small blood vessels in your eyes constrict. Then you will put one drop in each eye, which will remove the redness, making your eyeballs look wider. Then you'll quickly move on to step number eight, which is using some tweezers. Now, most men just pluck their eyebrow hairs without realizing that there's a correct way to do so. The mistake most men is that they'll grab their hair from the top or middle of the hair strand. They'll pluck, but all they'll really do is break the hair in half, not pulling out the entire hair. According to Mayo Clinic, this can lead to ingrown hairs. So, instead I want you to tweeze your hair all the way from the bottom, pulling out the entire strand. But to do it correctly, you need to shape your eyebrows and to get the right dimensions to make your face look more structured. You need a comb where you're gonna line it up on your left nostril going up to the corner of your eye. Anything past the comb, you can tweeze. You will then repeat the same process on the other side. So far, in eight minutes, you have showered, used a hair dryer to increase texture, shaved and structured your beard, moisturized, protected your skin, locked in your hair, whitened your teeth, perfected your lips, whitened your eyes, and even tweezed your eyebrows. Everything that you did is not only more, but will make you more attractive. And we're only eight minutes in. There's still two minutes left, which are my two most important tips. Number nine, apply fragrance to the three most important pulse points. As you put down your tweezers, I then want you to immediately reach for your cologne. According to a study by the Social Issues Research Center, men who use cologne were found to experience less tension, fatigue, and anger when compared to those men that didn't use it. So to maximize your cologne, I want you to spray it in your pulse points. You're gonna spray once on both wrists and then once on each side of the neck. Doing this right after you just moisturized your skin will ensure that your fragrance sits on top of your skin, making it last longer. And finally, you are ready for the 10th and final step of this 10 minute morning routine. I want you to blow dry problem areas to eliminate sweat patches. Look, when you're moving this fast, your heart rate's racing, especially if you hit the gym in the morning, you're probably gonna be a little bit sweaty and you don't wanna leave the house with sweat stains on your armpits. Not only does it make you look less attractive, but it also defeats the purpose of having a good fragrance because you will stink. So using a hairdryer on the coolest setting, I want you to air dry problem areas. That is your armpits, your chest, and even your private region. Now that these areas are cool, everything that you did this morning will remain in place, making you look more attractive than any other guy and saving you over 200 hours a year. If you guys wanna to continue to level up, I'll leave you two more videos here that you can watch. See you boys next time.